Hey guys, what's up? My name is Dee and welcome back to a new Costco Canada shop with me. The Garden Center is back at Costco. Let's see what else is new this week. This week at Costco, new sales have started. One of the first items I saw at the entryway is this new Shark vacuum. It has the most suction for the best hair pickup. So if you have a lot of shed hair in your house, whether it's from you or your pets, or you just have a lot to get off your floors, this would be a good option. Shark makes really great quality vacuums, and this one is coming in at $299.99, and you're saving $100 off the original price. I also found a sale on Duracell AAA batteries, so if you're looking to replenish your battery supply, Costco does have a wide variety of different batteries to choose from. They also have a battery daddy to store them, see if that's available near you. This week I found Pine Sol, the lavender scent is on sale until the 14th for $9.99. I also found a sale on this Winix air purifier. I've been on the market for an air purifier for quite some time, so I'm considering getting this one. Make sure you come back on Sunday to see my latest Costco haul. I'll share everything I pick up from my shop today. This air purifier is on sale until the 14th for $139.99. If you're new to Costco and you're trying to figure out the sale and savings pattern, basically there's new savings almost every two weeks and there's usually monthly sales that go on. There are some months where there will be a crossover sale. The sale doesn't end until sometime in the next month. So on my shop today, you'll notice there's a lot of sales that are ending on the 14th and there's also some sales that are ending on May 5th. So make sure you're paying attention to the items that you're interested in getting and you're keeping note of when the sales end because that'll ensure you don't go out to the store, try to get something and miss out on a really awesome saving. Sometimes that's the worst case scenario. And if you do end up getting something and it goes on sale shortly after, make sure you go to Costco and you ask for a price adjustment. You'll go to the returns line. You'll need your membership number, the product number, and your receipt. For your receipt, it can be a printout receipt or it can be one that you pull up on the Costco app and all your receipts are stored there as well and you'll be able to prove that you've purchased it and they'll adjust the difference and they'll refund you the amount that goes back to the original way that you paid. You normally have 30 days to do so, but some sales start over in like a week or two. So you really gotta pay attention to all these sales when they end, they have to be available in the store for you to go ahead and take advantage of that price adjustment. Continuing on with my shop, this Marshall speaker is very retro and I think this would be a great decor item, but also great for a home speaker. So if you're interested in finding a retro speaker, this is also a Bluetooth option. It's $359.99. You're saving $130 off getting this at Costco. Also, there's a sale on these security cameras. So if you're looking to get this for your home or business, I think this would be an interesting option to consider. You're saving $70 off the original price of this one. Make sure you get that before the sale ends if you are interested. I also found another sale on another speaker. It's the Pathfinder 320 by Ion. Costco has so many speakers that roll out in the warehouse, especially in the summertime. And I have to admit, some of the prices are really, really good. So keep note of that. Next up, I found some secret markdowns near the entryway and near the cash register. So see if your local Costco has any new manager markdowns in warehouse. They'll likely look like this where they're crossed off the price and they put the new price up. Some of the deals are really good like this one. These Zulu half gallon water bottles are a great deal right now. You're getting the two pack. There's two different packages to choose from. Two huge water bottles for $14.97. I think that's an amazing deal. I also found a sale on these bench flip-flops and I think that they are super lightweight and comfy. They're $12.99. The sale ends soon. And this week, the garden center just rolled out at Costco. So go and check your local Costco and see if the garden center is there near you. 
Right now they have some oregano, they also have some other herbs, they even have strawberries and other berries out already. So if you're hoping to grow some strawberries this year, just make sure you protect them because the animals love them. We bought strawberries from Costco in a previous summer and I have to admit we did grow some really amazing looking strawberries. We couldn't eat them because the animals and bugs beat us to it but they do also have parsley. I grew that last year and it was super healthy, too much for me to keep up with, and I also grew some thyme. Now, with that being said, let's go ahead and tour what's available in the garden center this year at Costco. There's so much to see, and it's never gonna look this neat and organized again. I happened to run in on the exact day that the garden center was opened, so I kinda got a first look of what's out, and I do have some information to share with you about what products are gonna be coming in soon. Products like tomatoes and cucumbers and zucchini, those type of products are not quite in the garden center yet. It's a little bit too cold for those to be available, but sometime in early May, you'll definitely find them. And what I have to say about tomatoes and cucumbers and zucchini and other things like that in the garden center at Costco, they sell so incredibly fast. So if you're planning to get it, don't wait until we get closer to the May 2-4 long weekend. Make sure that you get it way in advance. You properly take care of it at home, indoors, until the temperatures are safe for you to plant it outdoors and then you can go ahead and get a head start to your garden season. Speaking of garden season, leave a comment to let me know what are you going to be planting this year? This year I plan to use a raised garden bed because we have a puppy and he gets into the garden and I think having a raised bed will help us to actually be able to harvest some things and grow them really well over the summer. My plans are to grow some tomatoes, some cucumbers. I definitely wanna to try to grow some string beans this year. And I'd also like to try and grow some uh, peppers because Bell peppers cost so much in the grocery store and I really want to try and grow some on my own. I definitely want to also plant some more thyme again this year. Growing fresh thyme is super easy to take care of and also really good. And I think if I have room for anything else, I might try to grow something that's not going to take up too much space. I'd love to grow zucchini again, but that takes up a lot of garden space and I'm sure T-Bone would walk right over that. Anyways, in today's video, I have a very exciting announcement to make. I'm hosting a new giveaway. Recently, we surpassed 15,000 subscribers, and I am simply just blown away by all the support y'all show me every single week. And a small token of my appreciation is to gift one of you a $50 shop card to enter this giveaway. You don't have to do anything. All you have to do is already be subscribed to my channel. Every month I view comments and this month in particular, I'm looking at comments and I'll be selecting someone by random to win the $50 shop card. This is the first video that's announcing it and I'm also gonna post my video on Sunday, my haul also mentioning the $50 shop card. Again, I'm selecting one winner, so stay tuned to see who is chosen and I'll announce a winner before the end of the month and I'll reach out to you. Make sure you don't give your information to anyone. You'll have instructions on how to claim your $50 shop card plus a special note from me to you. So with that being said, I just wanted to thank you all so much for your continuous support. I am going to get a good look at what's here in this garden center and I'll be back in a little bit for more shopping.
Just a quick heads up, the strawberry plants sell very quickly, so if you plan to get these, make sure you get them sooner rather than later. Unfortunately, they're missing a price this week. Leave a comment to let me know how often would you like to see Garden Center updates this year. Every week they put out new products and I feel like each week it's just so hard to keep up. I'm good with going in every other week, but if you want to see what's available each week, let me know in the comments below. So far, so good Garden Center 2024. Now back in warehouse, I found a new sensory garden set and enchanted rainforest set. These are sensory bins, so it's great for kids who like to keep busy. Wouldn't recommend it to kids three and under, but definitely early school age kids. I think they'd have a lot of fun with this. It's $24.99. Also, these better than balloons, Nerf water balloons are in warehouse. They're $19.99. You get 432 pieces. I also found a new bunch of bubbles, Bubble Blaster. This is $24.99 and I can't believe I said bubbles that many times. I also found a three pack set of water blasters. These are really good. I bought them in a previous year and they do eventually go on sale. So watch for a sale on that one. Next up, let's head to the snack section. These Unreal bars are so incredibly delicious. They're a healthier way for you to have your sweet pickup treat and these are on sale for $9.99. I also found a really good sale on these Celebration mini chocolate chip cookies. These are great for making s'mores, but much easier. I like that these come in the individual pack. It's great for portion control. If I had to recommend you trying a new snack, I'm gonna recommend trying these organic coconut clusters. Let me tell you, these are so good. You will end up having a fight with your best friend over them because you don't want to share them. They're that good. So if you're a fan of a healthy way to have sweet treats, this is a great option for you. I highly recommend it. I gotta say it's one of my favorites. Costco also has Mr. Freeze Jumbo Freezies back in warehouse. This is a summer staple at Costco. It's always here. It's $14.99 this year. If you like these Nestle pack of full chocolate bars, this is also on sale for $14.99. There's also some new pool and beach towels in the warehouse for kids. I really like the colors and the prints of these. I find they're super bright, easy to find, and the patterns are actually really nice. They're $19.99 though and about $3 more than the other options that they have in warehouse. I'm going to recommend you trying the seven grain salad. It's great for a quick and easy healthy side. With this sale at $7.99, it's too good of a deal to pass up. There's also a sale on this two pack of quiche. I think I've tried this before at a sample table and it was pretty good, but I can't remember which quiche I tried. And by the way, Kiwi is back in the warehouse, except it's from Italy and Greece this time. So check it out and see if that's available near you. On this week's Cucumber Watch, the price is changing again. The three of them are $3.39, so see what the price is by you. I also found some new chicken sausages in the warehouse. They're teriyaki flavor. They actually look really good. And the price seems pretty reasonable, $18.99 for chicken teriyaki sausages. Leave a comment and let me know if you've tried any of the chicken sausages at Costco. And if you have, which one is your number one favorite? Because I think I want to try one, but I'm not sure if I'll like it. And I definitely want to try one that comes in highly recommended by the people that I trust most other Costco shoppers. One of the things I love about this online community I've built is everyone's ability to just be brutally honest about products and what was actually worth spending the money on and what was a complete fail. So, you know, at Costco, there's literally thousands and thousands and thousands of products and it can get so overwhelming figuring out what new products should you try, right? And I have to admit, the sample table does help me a lot when it comes to trying new products. And sometimes I just really go in blind and I hope, I hope that there's just something good that's gonna come from the new thing that I'm trying. Sometimes I am mind blown and so surprised and impressed. 
and other times I feel like you know it's just not right for me it's not that the products not amazing it's just it's not right for me I do have to share that a friend of mine tried this tempura shrimp taco kit and they said it was absolutely amazing they would buy it again and again so this gets a thumbs up recommendation and there's a new meal kit in the warehouse this is like barbecue pork with potatoes so if you were interested in a quicker way to get your meals and you were interested in trying out meal kits, just wanted to highlight that Costco actually does have some pretty amazing meal kits. Some of them are definitely worth getting more than others, but everyone has their own preference. And of course, you try what you think is best for you. Make sure you read the ingredients list. Make sure it's something that you're truly going to love before you purchase. I am going to recommend you picking up the corn at Costco. It's always fresh and really, really good. It's definitely not the cheapest price because going to a local farm is much cheaper and you'll get bigger, you know, corn. But at Costco, $7.99, you can't go wrong. I think that's a great price and perfect for barbecue season, including these aluminum pans. They're on sale. Get them for your barbecue season. And also get some lunch plates so you don't have to do as many dishes. This is perfect for barbecue season as well. And the sale for this is ending really soon on the 14th. I'm actually going to stock up on these. So that's it for my shop today. I'm headed to check out. Don't forget about the new giveaway that I announced in this video. And I'll catch you all on Sunday for my new Costco haul. Thanks for spending your time here with me.